you know what time it is. Here are 50 amazing facts to blow your mind. There's a city in Kansas called Gas that was named for the abundant amount of gas that was discovered in the area. The city's motto is don't pass gas, stop and enjoy it. Black tomatoes can be grown without any genetic engineering. They are full of beneficial anthocyanins, which are believed to help with obesity, cancer, and diabetes. Most cats don't like to drink water if it's too close to their food source. Always keep your cat's water and food supply separate so they don't get dehydrated. Aside from stock footage of historical people, Stephen Hawking is the only person to date to have played himself in an episode of Star Trek. During World War II, a 14-year-old boy named Jacqueline Lucas lied his way into the military and became the youngest marine ever to earn a medal of honor. When he was 17, he threw himself on two live grenades to protect his squad members and survived. DC Comics published an alternate universe where Bruce Wayne dies instead of his parents. In it, Thomas Wayne becomes Batman and Martha Wayne goes crazy and becomes the Joker. In 2003, neurosurgeon and CNN medical correspondent Sanjay Gupta saved Marine Jesus Vidana's life after he was shot in the head in Iraq. He did this by performing brain surgery using a Black & Decker drill bit. Romanian tennis player Simona Halp used to have 34 double D breasts until she got breast reduction surgery to make her more agile while playing. Well, it worked because since then she has climbed the ranks in the tennis world. Hippos like to lick crocodiles. They're not a threat so the crocs tolerate it. Watson, IBM's artificially intelligent computer learned how to swear from the Urban Dictionary. Because of that, it it began talking sassy, so scientists had to remove the entire Urban Dictionary database from its memory. During World War II, Hitler had a plan to destroy Russia by killing 4 million inhabitants of Moscow and covering it with an artificial lake. The Indonesian Ministry of Marine Affairs and Fisheries determined that a single manta ray, if caught and killed, is worth anywhere from 40 to $500. However, they also determined that if kept alive, they're worth up to $1 million in tourism revenue so they created the largest manta ray sanctuary in the world. Maufti Zakaria, a poet, wrote the Algerian national anthem in his own blood on his prison cell walls after he was imprisoned by the French Imperial forces in 1955. The children's book Where the Wild Things Are was originally titled Where the Wild Horses Are, however author and illustrator Maurice Sendek ended up changing the name of it after he realized he had no idea how to draw horses. An Indonesian boy named Artie Rizal began chain smoking when he was just 18 months old and continued smoking over 40 cigarettes a day until he was 5 years old when he was sent to rehab. The state of Illinois has banned exfoliating face washes because the microbeads in them are so small that they actually slip through the water treatment facilities and end up back in the water supply. The first recorded human flight with artificial artificial wings in history was in the 6th century in China. Emperor Cao Yang would strap prisoners to kites and throw them off buildings to see if they could fly. A psychologist named Timothy Leary was sent to jail in 1970 and given a series of tests to determine which jail he should be placed in. Since he designed many of the tests himself, he manipulated his answers so that he would be placed in a low security prison as a gardener and ended up escaping only 8 months later. After needing a blood donation when he was young, an Australian man named James Harrison began donating blood as soon as he turned 18. Amazingly, it was discovered that he has a rare antibody in his blood that cures rhesus disease and has since donated blood over 1,000 times, saving an estimated 2.4 million babies from the disease. Ken McElroy was a notorious bully who terrorized residents of Missouri for years. He was shot in 1981 in broad daylight in an act of vigilante justice with dozens of onlookers watching. However, no one came forward saying that they saw anything and the case remains unsolved to this day 30 years later. Noah Webster, the creator of the first ever American dictionary, learned 26 languages so that he could understand and research the origins of his own country's tongue in order to write it. The word J used to be used as slang for a dull or stupid person, so anyone who ignored traffic regulations and crossed roads illegally was called a jaywalker. Girdling or ring barking is the term used to describe the removal of a strip of bark from the circumference of a tree's branch or trunk. If the main trunk of a tree is girdled, it will die if it cannot regrow from above to bridge the wound. Walt Disney used to visit his parks in disguise and test ride operations to make sure that they weren't rushing guests. 
This is Gunner, the air raid siren dog. During World War II, he alerted aircraft personnel that Japanese aircraft were approaching because his hearing was so acute and accurate. The most well-known cut for a diamond is the brilliant cut. When done perfectly on a round diamond, something called the Cupid effect appears, which is a pattern of arrows and hearts that can be seen if you shine a light through it. In 1999, Lena Howe, a physicist at Harvard, became the first person ever to slow light down to only 17 meters per second using a machine called a Bose-Einstein condensate. And only two years later, she succeeded in stopping light entirely. Barcode scanners actually read the spaces between the black bars, not the black bars themselves. Employees who play different cartoon characters at Disneyland never ever break character. They're even given special autograph training sessions so that they can always sign autographs in the style of the cartoon character they're playing. Iron Man was created by Stan Lee in 1963 at the height of the Cold War when people hated war and the military. He did this as a challenge to himself to see if he could create a character that everyone would hate and yet still try to shove it down their throats to make them like him. And obviously he succeeded. A study conducted in 2011 by Angela Duckworth proved that IQ tests can be affected by motivation. By promising subjects monetary rewards, she found that the higher the reward, the higher they scored on the IQ test. The US Embassy, located in Baghdad, Iraq, is the largest and most expensive embassy in the world, spanning more than 104 acres and costing more than $750 million. In Finland, babies sleep in cardboard boxes. Seriously. Expectant mothers are given starter kits from the state filled with clothes, sheets, toys, and even a little mattress to put in the box to use as a bed. It's a tradition that has continued since the 1930s. Galalith was an inexpensive synthetic plastic that was developed in the early 1900s that was made out of milk protein. It was odorless, biodegradable, anti-allergenic, and virtually inflammable. However, unfortunately, because it could not be molded after the plastic was set, production ended in the 1960s. Before Will Smith starred in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, he was on the verge of bankruptcy owing the government $2.8 million. In fact, for the first three seasons of the show, he had to pay the IRS 70% of his income. There's a lake in Australia called Lake Disappointment that was named and found by Frank Hahn in 1897 who was hoping to find fresh water but instead found salt water. National Geographic star Casey Anderson has a pet grizzly bear named Brutus. The bear was adopted in 2002 when he was a newborn cub and in 2008 served as Casey's best man at his wedding. Seriously. Peachtree City in Georgia has a 145 kilometer network of pathways dedicated to pedestrian and golf cart use. Most of the city owns golf carts that use them as an extra car to get around for local transportation. Filani Ladla is a homeless man from Johannesburg, South Africa who's known as the Pavement Bookworm. He survives by reviewing books for people passing on the street and sells them the book if they like it. Researchers from the University of California in 2013 found that 29 percent of San Francisco's pollution comes from China. The hazardous air from China can travel all the way to the west coast of America within only days if the weather conditions are right. There's an amusement park in Las Vegas called Dig This where you get to drive construction equipment over a giant sandbox. I want to do that. This is a golden tiger. They're the result of inbreeding between white and orange tigers held in captivity. They are extremely rare because they're not intentionally bred. Chiyun Sugihara was a famous Japanese diplomat that operated in Lithuania during World War II. He helped more than 6,000 Jewish refugees escape to Japanese territory by issuing them transit visas, risking his life and his family's life in the process. When a new building was being constructed for Scotland Yard, one of the world's best known police agencies, a dismembered torso of a woman was found. The case was called the Whitehall Mystery and was never solved, meaning that Scotland Yard was built upon an unsolved crime scene. Lotso the Bear from Toy Story Story 3 was originally supposed to be in the first movie, but the technology needed to create his fur wasn't available at the time, so he got pushed back to the third movie. Insurance companies have blacklisted Jackie Chan and anyone else who works on his stunt team. This means that if anyone gets injured while on the set of a Jackie Chan movie, he has to pay for their recovery treatment. In 1861, a slave named Robert Smalls fought his way to freedom by seizing a Confederate ship and delivering it to the Union. He ultimately became a 
major general and even bought the original house that he was a slave in, reuniting with his mother. The oldest hotel in the world is the Nishiyama Onsen Kyunkan in Japan. It was founded in 705 AD and has had 52 generations of the same family operating it since it was founded. Every spring, a set of 21 swings is set up near a bus stop in Montreal's entertainment district. Every one of them acts as a musical instrument and as people swing, pre-recorded sounds fill the air. The pizza named Louis 8 is the most expensive pizza in the world, costing $12,000. Created by chef Renato Viola, he prepares the entire dish at your house. The toppings include three types of caviar, Mediterranean lobster, and red prawns, and the size of the pizza is only 20 centimeters in diameter. Yikes. And that's all for this time guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give that like button a click. And if you'd like to see future videos from me, be sure to click that red subscribe button because I upload every Tuesday and Saturday. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you later on both my second channel and on my social media. Peace.